Freshman boys basketball trials will be held this Saturday, October 29th at 2 p.m. in the PE Center. Bring your own clothes and shoes. If you have any questions, ask Coach Wheeler in room 108. Abla, all permission slips for a Rizzuto field trip must be given to Miss Busatach by end of Wednesday. At the school, there will be an officer meeting, and tomorrow there will be a brief member meeting in Mr. B's room number 76. Congratulations to the following Bulldog Choir members who competed for the Places in Region 19 Honor Choir Competition. Alyssa Ross, Morgan Hansen, Brianna Johnson Martinez, Ruben Barrera, Thomas Diancy, Austin Gorby, Ian Small, and Eric Mila. Senior Megan Miller was named the competition in the next level of All-State auditions. Congratulations to all of those who put so much hard work to represent LPHS. Lamar University of Beaumont will be here Tuesday. This university is known for programs in the medical field. If you are interested in finding out more, get a pass from Ms. Holland in the front office. Congratulations to our orchestra students who made an all region 19 orchestra this past weekend at Pasadena Memorial High School. Angelica Castillo made the Philharmonic Orchestra on string bass. Thomas Hootman, Kimberly Berg, David, David Kispe, and Chad Johnson all made the Philharmonic Orchestra on violin. Additionally, Liz Westmerlin qualified on string bass to try out for the All-State Orchestra last Saturday. Liz records this weekend at the area tryout at Dobie High School. Good luck. Mu Alpha Theta is meeting this weekend on Wednesday at 2.45 and Thursday morning at 6.45. Students interested in membership are invited and encouraged to attend. This meeting will be in room 101. Mega Pictures are next Tuesday. Monday, November 1st. NHS meeting meetings are Wednesday and Thursday of next week. There is an art club meeting today in room 20. Now, please stay tuned for more LP TV. Hi. I'm Ms. Wasey, my room number is 67, and I'm here to give you an impassioned plea for your help in our third annual Haunted High School. It'll be taking place this next Monday night, Halloween night, from 5.30 until 7.30 p.m. What we need from you is candy, candy, and more candy. This event, in its third year, each year has grown bigger and bigger, and the young people of Laporte look forward to this even more so sometimes than regular trick-or-treating. In order for us to provide that safe, fun environment, we need your help. We need two things. Anybody who is willing to help decorate, and that would be after school tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday, and possibly for a short time Friday, then we'll be up here on Saturday from 11 o'clock until we get finished. We would appreciate your help. You can earn community service hours that will count towards NHS credit and other organizations. So come on up and help us decorate. Candy, 
Everybody bring candy. Bring it to room 67 or room 54. You can get points for student council for bringing candy. Uh, you can get credit for other organizations. We're sending out a shout out to ABLA, NAF, NHS. If you decorate and bring candy, you can get credit for community service. Uh, Interact, Chados, Mu Alpha Theta, FFA, Hope, and all organizations on campus. Please bring your candy to us by this Friday, or if you come to decorate on Saturday, we'll take it then as well. The more candy we get, the more fun it will be. There'll be costume contests. Now remember, you student, you high school students are not allowed to come unless you're working for an organization. So make sure that your organization gets your name on the list and come and help us out. Thank you. Where do you want to go with your future career? Come to the Career Exploration Expo, November 3rd from 5 to 7 in the Student Center. Visit with business members of our community. Talk with local employers about various high-wage career options that do not require a college degree. There will be $50 gift certificates given away to some lucky attendees. Hope to see you there next Thursday night in the Student Center for the Career Expo. It's from 5 to 7. And now for Words of Wisdom with Mr. Shabby. Hello again. Good morning, LaPorte High School. This is Mr. Shoppy with a few words of wisdom. There are times when it's good to focus only on ourselves, to get to know and understand ourselves a little better, and to work toward our own special goals and dreams. But what happens when we spend too much time doing for ourselves and not enough time doing for others? Now listen to these words from the late American comedian Danny Thomas. Mr. Thomas spent a lifetime giving time and energy to St. Jude's Children's Hospital because he wanted all children, rich and poor, to receive the medical care they needed. He says, success in life has nothing to do with what you gain in life or accomplish for yourself. It's what you do for others. Today, take a little time to do something special for someone else. Give someone a pat on the back or offer kind words of support. Remember, learning to be a truly successful person is learning to be a person who cares about others. With something to think about, this is Mr. Shoppy. Make it a great day or not, the choice is yours. That's all, folks.